hey guys welcome to my channel my name is Celia if you're new to this channel and um, today's video is just really about really a week in a life having locks but this week I'm actually getting my retie done I'm getting my hair washed and I'm just gonna be showing you guys like different ways of how I prepare for my retie appointments and what I do after my retie appointment so you guys kind of get an idea of how I take care of my hair on a week-to-week -week basis right now I just came from the gym and um, I usually sometimes I wear a baseball hat to the gym because it kind of holds everything down. The lining of the hat kind of catches my sweat rather than it dripping down to my ends and making them looser. But yeah, I'm just taking off my hat and you know, I'm about to take a shower since I just came from the gym and I'm about to throw my shower cap on because you know, I always wear my shower cap in the shower because the humidity, I take really, really hot showers and the humidity definitely can expand my ends and my um, roots and make them a little puffier in return making everything a little bit looser so that's just how I protect my hair when I take a shower y'all it is the next day and what did I tell you guys like about Georgia it is raining it is raining it is pouring it is coming down and I forgot my shower cap so my hair got a little bit poofy and unfortunately this is the day I'm supposed to be getting my retie so Hey guys, so I just arrived to my loctician's salon and I'm about to go in to get my retie. I haven't asked her yet, so we're gonna see how this goes. So before I actually came to my retie appointment, hold on. Before I actually came to my retie appointment, um, I went ahead and I went through my edges like a week ago and I just kind of like braided down my edges that were really loose and just not like, you know, intact and everything like that so that they're kind of lengthened and stretched out so she could grasp them and create new locks out of them so i'm about to take them out really quick i came to my appointment a little bit early for everybody who um doesn't know which salon i go to um the salon i go to it's called all tangled up llc owner is um sean so if you guys are interested in getting some locks in Atlanta, that's her. Yeah, let's see how this goes. Maybe I could get lost in the Can't get enough of you. Baby, give me good love. Boy, you give me good love. Maybe I could get lost in the Can't get enough of you. Baby, give me good love. So, you know, I kind of sprung up me doing the video last minute on my lactation and she wanted to do like a more better video with her involved in it next time because she felt like she wasn't ready. Totally, you know, agree. I understand that because I kind of like randomly said it and, you know, sometimes people have to be prepared for that. But she did take a before video and um, this is my after video. I did find out about a new show though. Um, oval that show was bomb but it took her about like we started at 6 30 we ended at like nine o'clock so about two and a half hours for her to do the retie it's my scalp i'm about to do a little hairology video it's a little flaky right now a little flaky but that's because i have to um wash it i'm gonna wash it later on this week you guys will see how that looks could see my crib oh and she also said 
she added new a couple of locks in the front so remember how i told you guys i like grabbed my edges and i like braided them up a little bit a week in advance to kind of stretch it out so she has like you know some locks to create because i want this whole hairline to be like full of locks so she grabbed some of my lock my edges and she made some new locks she said hopefully they last i'm going to take really good care of them so that they do last my hair is really dry right now and flaky i'm going to wash it okay guys i'm just waking up this is the pillowcase that i sleep on i'm gonna show you guys how my hair looks um just some sleeping on the pillowcase. So if I were to wear my bonnet hat, it would have been a little bit neater and more in place, but um, I just got my hair retightened and my scalp's a little sore, so I didn't want any pressure on my head while sleeping. So this is how it looks when you just sleep on the pillowcase, but no fear, we could fix that. I wanted to show this part just to show you guys that like you know your hair is never going to really be intact and perfect all the time you kind of got to maneuver it especially when you wake up and give it some life you know spray some water on it and loosen it up so it looks a bit cute again it's not a lot to do like at all it literally takes me like five minutes to get this done and then I'm back to normal, to my normal fullness and everything like that. Good morning guys, I just woke up and I braided and banded, well I didn't braid, I just banded my hair, now it looks pretty crazy right now, but I'm trying to see if this will make a difference compared to how I usually do it, I went ahead and sectioned it and I'm about to go hop in the shower and wash my hair. Getting started, getting started right here, getting started right here. About time for you to get it started. Getting started right here, getting started right here. About time for you to get it started. Getting started right here, getting started right here. 